Hey there, Chad Bonjour here for Ohio University Libraries. In this video, I'll be using a database called Emergent Intellect to identify potential locations for opening your business. This is a great way to identify potential competitors in your market, as well as looking at a particular address and trying to figure out, is this a viable place to open my establishment based upon what companies are around me? You know, are, are people going to go visit other companies and then come to my place? Or is my company that I'm potentially looking at in a location way out in, in the boondocks, nobody's going to visit. So this video is going to show you how to do that using a database called Mergent Intellect. So here you go. So we can use Mergent Intellect to actually do um, look for companies in our approximate location where we're looking at opening a business. So what we're going to do is actually do an advanced search. And let's say we have a particular address or a, a zip code in mind of where we want to open our business. So what we can do is actually look for location. And let me get rid of this guy here so you can see this. There is a radius search. So I want to open a business within three miles of a zip code 04015, which is somewhere in, not zero, 04015, which is uh, somewhere way off in, in Vermont. So, all right, so we did that. We have three miles of 04015, okay. And if we just ran that, we're going to get like 155 companies and we can view our results there. All right. So when we view our results, it comes to this page and we see there's like Hancock Lumber Company, Sand and Gravel Incorporated, Spurwink School, Assista Living Place. Those are all nice companies and all, but you know, if I'm going to open a particular retail establishment, you know, probably the fact that there is a residential care facility or a Hancock Lumber Company is not really going to make a bit of difference or a Sebago Dock and Lift Incorporated really is not going to draw customers to my potential retail location. So I'm going to go back and uh, change this search. Go back to our advanced search again. All right, we still have our radius of zip code right now. Now I'm going to go under industry. And what I want to do is go under and see what other, I'm going to open a retail establishment, maybe in the line of like health foods or health food store or organic food store or something like that. So I want to see what other retail trade is happening in my location. So if I just say I want to know what other food stores are over there, maybe what other apparels are there, maybe furniture stores, other restaurants, other miscellaneous retail, general merchandise stores. Notice I don't care about like building materials right now. I mean, I guess I could, but... Um, I'm mainly interested in retail trade, not like manufacturing that kind of stuff. If you want to get more granular, you could go down and say, let's you know open this up here and say, let's look for um, hardware stores or retail nurseries and garden stores and that kind of stuff. Okay, so once we do that, we can add to our criteria. All right, and then we can go and run our search again. So rather than 155 stores, we've now found 12 companies in that area. So that's a lot. That's a big difference. So we view our results here. Once again, it takes us to the same type of page here. And so now we have like, here's Bob's Place, Top of the Hill Grill, Optical Solution Incorporated, uh, Crossroads Country Store. So, and there's a Antiques Place, right? So not like, this isn't exactly shopping Mecca here in this particular zip code. So I'm not really sure that that's the place we want to locate our store. But this, is like, this will help you kind of give you an idea as far as what's available uh, at that location. Okay, so uh, it might be a good way to do a radius search of a particular zip code to say, you know what, um, maybe that's not where I want to build. That's not where I want to be located. So this is how you use Mergent Intellect to find that information. You can also use Mergent Intellect to find out uh, potential competitors in your location. And once again, we're going to go to Advanced Search and then we'll go under Location. In this case, I'm going to do County. So I'm interested in the county of, and we're going to do North America. I'm interested in the county of um, Cumberland County, Maine is what I'm looking for here. So I'm going to go and look for Maine and choose Cumberland and then add to criteria. It's going to add it over here on the right hand side. And then finally I want to look for um, uh, particular companies in a particular industry. So I'm going to go over and look under industry and go under, I'm looking for uh, wholesale retail and let's see there's miscellaneous retail. Let's see what we have here. We have sporting goods, liquor stores, things like that. Let's look under food stores. And let's see here. Here is grocery stores, uh, miscellaneous food stores. What I'm looking for really is like uh, how many like health food stores there are around this particular location. So we do that. 
Go way down, click the Add Criteria, and then we run our search. And it finds 25 companies associated with that, with that SIC code in this database uh, in Cumberland um, County, Maryland. And we can click on View Results. We'll get our list of companies here on the next page. So here's our list of companies here. You see there's the traditional GNC. There is a, a National Mar Natural Marketplace. There is Royal River Natural Foods, things like that. So we click on a, a company here. We'll give us a little bit of information about the company including things like uh, who the owner is, stuff like that, where it's located, if they have a website, uh, credit rating, things like that, that are pretty good there. So you can also, what's interesting is look at, uh, you know, there's not a whole lot of financial details because these are you know, primarily um, private companies, but you can see what other companies are around there. So we click on surrounding companies, we can see if there's other companies in the, in the location. Uh, again, this is a different way of looking at that kind of radius search. We're looking at all companies uh, surrounding uh, this particular particular location here, and here's our list of of um, of, uh, of companies here. There's uh, quite a few within one mile, and you see we can get get a nice list of those companies there as well. So, good way to kind of benchmark uh, your market, your uh, list of companies, and also figure out where you might want to locate your business using Mergent Intellect. Hope this video helped you. Should you need more help, look for the contact link on the business blog. We've got to help any way I can. Take care and have a great day.